Thank you very much. Uh, I want to thank the WGO leadership for honoring me with this award. It is with great humility that I received this award precisely in the city where my grandfather lived and worked as a tram driver. I know that I am honored today thanks to the hardship that my grandparents and parents had to go through to give their children a future grounded in the privilege of education. An education that enabled me to set the highest goals, an education that allowed me to get to WGO and take part in the improvement of the speciality in the developing world. I'll be forever grateful to them, as I will be to the WGO, for letting me be part of a community that doesn't only promote better gastroenterology, but also forges social justice. Today, I would like to remember some of the dear colleagues I had the chance to work with and learn from, starting with Meinhard Klassen and Guido Tietgat, who were the first to open the doors of this new world for me. I want to express my special gratitude to Eamon Quigley, Richard Kozarek, Michael Fried, not only because it was a real privilege to receive their valuable advice all along, but what is even more important, because I always felt their warm support and friendship. And allow me to wish a bright future to the organization that will be, for the first time, in the hands of a woman, mm -hmm. coming also as a premier from Africa, my friend Naiman Brani. I also want to mention Bridget Barbieri and Kale Mutri, who were by my side, ready to help me at every moment. And finally, I would like to thank everybody who came all the way from Uruguay and Bolivia to share this honor with me. My colleagues at home are today represented by Carolina Olano, one of my right hands at the University Gastroenterology Department in Montevideo. Elena Fosman, my mentor, who guided my first steps into gastroenterology, and Guido Villagomez, with whom I shared so much in gastroenterology and in life during the last 27 years. I want to thank also Eduardo Ache, who is not just a dear old friend. He's the past president of the greatest, greatest football team ever, national <laughs> from Uruguay. And very specially, I would like to finish my, by thanking my dear family, my mother and wife, who are here today, and my children, who couldn't make it, but are always with me. Thank you all very much.